We're going to replace a grinder power cord. This get worn out over time, and it can be dangerous. In time, protector will crack and expose the wires. Always unplug any electrical tools, before performing any repairs. We are going to start by removing the shield protector. This is a DeWalt angle grinder, as many of you can tell, just by the color. Find the screws holding the covers together, in this particular grinder we have the total of 8 screws. Remove the screws using a T20 Torx bit, and put them aside. If you are already watching the video, don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. Using a flat screwdriver, pry open and remove the cover. Pull back the cable protector, and look for the wires, it shouldn't be confusing, since it's only two wires. Before cutting the old cord, Make sure to leave enough slug to reconnect the new cord, either by soldering or using butt connectors. Cut the cable insulator equally on all four ends. If you plan to use butt connectors, make sure there's enough room inside the cover. Install two pieces of heat shrink tube on new plug, and reattach the wires to its corresponding color. In this case, we are going to be soldering the wires. Let it cool off for a few seconds. Slide back the heat shrink tube, and using a lighter, or a heat gun, apply heat to seal the connection.
Reinstall the cord back on its position. Some grinders have a clamp to secure the cord. This one it's missing the clamp and screws. I'm not sure if it has been opened in the past, or this model came without the clamp. Now it's time to install the cover back on place. Make sure everything goes back in the same order that it came out. Install all the screws on place and secure them. Continue by installing the grinding wheel protector and screws. We're done. We have replaced a damaged cord on an angle grinder. Plug it into a power outlet and test it. We went from a 4 feet cord, to a 9 feet cord, that was removed from an old vacuum. Thanks for watching if you made it all the way, don't forget to share like and subscribe.